Hey everyone, this is Joey with 22 Halo Media, and today I'm going to be showing you how you can use a plugin called Simple Banner to add a banner ad to the top or bottom of your website. So the very first thing you're going to need to do is get signed into the WordPress dashboard. And once you're in the WordPress dashboard, you'll click on plugins in the left, and then you'll go ahead and click add new plugin. You'll go to the search plugins bar and type in simple banner. And then you want to click install now for the very first result, which will be simple banner an easy to use banner bar notification announcement for the top or bottom of your website. You'll click activate and then you'll click refresh now. And then simple banner will come up in the toolbar on your left. So you'll click on simple banner. And then uh, I've actually already added the banner from earlier. So the simple banner text is already there. But what you would do is you'd go ahead and copy and paste the banner in there, just like that. And then you click save changes. Now you do have some options. I recommend uh, checking the close button enabled option and what that does is it makes it so people can close the ad i think you should always give people the option to do that you could also change different colors like the banner background color the banner text color the link color and the close button color the close button color was originally black and i changed it to white because it's easier to see on that blue now you may have issues where um the banner doesn't uh it's not responsive so something that I found out uh, that I needed to do for my theme is I needed to make the max width of the image less than 100%. And the way you could do that is you go ahead and delete everything in your URL up to the WordPress admin. And then you type in customize.php. And you just got to add in a little bit of additional CSS. And for this, I just made the image max width 100%. And then you could see that banner ad, it will go ahead and be responsive because without that, um, if I get rid of that customized, that custom CSS, you'll see that, uh, when I go ahead, I might need to refresh it. Yeah. You see how it's broken like that? Well, the custom CSS that I had the max width being um, at least 100% for all images. So the max width is only 100% of its uh, parent container. So you just need that custom CSS and that'll fix that issue. If you're having a problem where the image is breaking and going past its parent containers boundary. So you just need to add that. And then if you refresh, you'll see that if you go into a mobile view, the banner ad is there. So I hope you enjoyed that video. It's just a super easy way to add um, a banner ad to the top or the bottom of your website. And not every single theme that you're using is going to need that custom CSS to make it responsive, but some do. For me, I'm using the default WordPress 2024 theme, and that one did need me to add the custom CSS. So I hope you enjoyed the video. And if you have any more questions or any ideas uh, for more videos, go ahead and leave a comment in the description. Thanks for watching. Bye.